outward. Mark 12, 31 and the second like it is this, you shall love your neighbor as yourself. There is no other commandment greater than these. The first commandment that Jesus um, emphasized was of course that we must love the Lord our God with all our being. But the second one he mentioned is for us to love our neighbor as ourself. So uh, God wants us to look outward. We generally have this tendency to think only about ourselves, pray for ourselves uh, and serve ourselves. But you know, God is calling us out of that and he's saying that he wants us to grow beyond ourselves. He wants us to grow out of self-centeredness. Uh, love your neighbor as yourself. Renewed thinking uh, is also for us to consider others. You know, there are many scriptures uh, that talk about how we must relate with others. Uh, Philippians 2-3 uh, reminds us the way Jesus humbled himself, that we too ought to humble ourselves, uh, that we must honor others. We must uh, give our life for others. As we relate with others, God wants us to mature um, and, and maturity is when we are walking in the spirit, when we are dealing with uh, the issues of the flesh uh, and we're constantly uh, uh, with an attitude of growth in God and that helps us to relate better with others, serve others, um, you know, the way God wants us to. Uh, and of course, you know, many other things that the Bible points out to us, which is to forgive others um, for the wrong that they've done because God has forgiven us uh, and to also respond to the needs of others you know as we look around uh, there can be many needs there can be small needs big needs but in whichever way possible you know as we uh, uh, find solutions for those needs uh, like Jesus we too will be serving the people in our lives and God really wants us to look beyond ourselves, uh, consider others, honor others, bless others uh, and love others as ourselves. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we pray God that you will give us the grace, Lord, to uh, lead a life, Father, where we, we, we give others, Lord, um, more honor than, than ourselves, Father God. And Lord, we pray that you will fashion each one of us, Lord, as those who lift up the heads of other people, Father God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you that there are many ministries within us, Father, that uh, that you want us, Lord, to, to release. And, and God, we want to see a mighty work of God, Lord, done across uh, this nation, Lord, as, as we bless the lives of other people. We thank you, God. We thank you for doing it. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.